Hi there, I'm Pastor Paul Santoro. I direct the Bellbrook Sugar Creek Ministerial Association. Today, I'm excited to share that many local churches, associations, and businesses have joined forces for this year's Christmas with a Cause community project, Grounds for Joy, a Bellhop Cafe makeover. Bellhop Cafe is a local spot for youth, young adults, businessmen and women, people of all ages to gather, to be refreshed, and to connect. It's supported by charitable donations and staffed by volunteers. But today, it's in need of a facelift. But it can't do it alone, so we're asking you for your help. Well, I've been coming here since they first opened. I usually come once a week. You know everybody who's here. They know you. It's just a very friendly place. Val Hop to me, if you've ever watched the TV series Cheers, where everybody knows your name, when you walk in, I mean, as people come through the door, as the evening's going on, it's like, hi, hi, you know, and, and you see the people, and you know, you get to know them, and talk to them, and they're not standoffish. They're very open and forthcoming, and it's it's very just a very nice atmosphere. I started coming here, I think, probably my eighth grade year. And I, get, I just came here to check it out and I ended up absolutely loving it. And I love Heather and Mike, they're so great and they're so loving to everyone. It's, it just warms my heart. I started coming to Bellhop for our one Thursday a month prayer breakfast that we have um, on the first Thursday of every month. That was my first time ever coming here, so I was like, oh, this place is cute, and they like, they love Jesus here, and it's just really awesome. We wanted to do something that would reach out to the community. It serves as a neighborhood gathering place, and a place to network the community together, and that's been the most amazing part of our whole journey. If somebody has a problem, they always know there's somebody here to talk to them. Somebody who, in a split second, will pray for them. I think there's a lot of people who come here who've heard through the grapevine that this is a really good place to come for a fellowship and friendship. And I think that's really important. We need that type of a, of a place to gather where people can feel like they can shed their skin and come in and be honest and somebody will be there for them. We're not trying to be the next Starbucks. The uh, pace here is slow and steady. My wife tells me that the coffee bar here has become my pulpit because one-on-one -on -one I can share our heart and vision with people, uh, let them know why we're here and why they're important. Now this building has been here a very, very long time. Um, it's a historic building and it would be nice to have some updates. I really do think this project, the fact that it will help bring awareness, because the community doesn't realize what a neat little, um, I don't know what you call it, diamond in the rough that we have. I just believe that Bellhop is very deserving of it, and um, I think that everyone should be in support of such a great ministry, because that's what it is. It's not just a coffee shop, it is a ministry outreach to the community. I'm in support of it because I know there's a lot of potential here. I mean, we have young kids come in and it's their first time playing in front of people and they come back the second and the third time and you can just see the growth and how how they blossom right before your eyes. The Grounds for Joy is beyond our uh, wildest expectation. We have been praying for uh, additional volunteer help, been praying for ways to increase our awareness in the community. So the Grounds uh, for Joy will provide as well a facelift here because much of our, everything that we have here now is kind of garage sale, pick it up as we could kind of uh, decor. And it's comfortable and inviting. We call it early garage sale decor, but uh, all of our furniture and equipment is dated and old and so it would, it's going to be a tremendous blessing to be able to update some of our equipment, some of our fixtures and furniture and so forth and uh, give us uh, a greater profile in the community. Will you help us make a difference at Bellhop? 
There are several ways you can show your support. One, pray for this project. Two, spread the word. Three, give sacrificially. And four, lend your talent and skills to the Makeover Project itself. Thank you for considering your part in this project. We look forward to sharing it with you.